Heather Graves, uh, Modesto Police Department Public Information Officer. Just after two o'clock, we stopped a vehicle um, on coffee. He actually pulled into a driveway of a residence there and um, fled on foot. He was armed with a handgun and then made his way over some fences into a residential neighborhood. Uh, officers in the SWAT team were able to track him down um, into a house um, on, in the 1300 block of Coffee Villa. Now, um, it seems like it's kind of a large response. Um, is there a reason for that? Like SWAT team, proper, all that stuff? Yes, um, I think uh, from what I understand, officers have, may have had contact with him in the past and with him fleeing with a gun, um, they felt that it was a high risk uh, situation, especially into a neighborhood, a residential neighborhood. And um, so they wanted to ensure the safety of those that are in this community. And just to clarify, on the initial stop, was that like a, just a regular traffic stop or what was that? Yes, it was a traffic stop. Okay, and then um, also to clarify, uh, was anybody injured or any shots fired or anything like that? No shots fired, nobody was injured, um, and he surrendered peacefully to the officers. And when you caught him, was he in somebody else's house or something? Or? Um, he was in a residence. I don't know who it belongs to, if he knows them or if he um, you know, broke in. At this point, it's, it's unknown. All right, well, thank you very much. You're welcome.